Hey guys, LuckyHD here, and welcome back to another video. In today's video, this is going to be your guide on how to get new Radiant Lumians inside of Lumian Legacy. In this video, we're also going to be talking about the chances to find these new Radiant Lumians and more. If you guys do enjoy this video, make sure you get another like and subscribe, and let's get straight into the video. Alrighty, now what is a Radiant Goppy? Now, a Radiant Goppy is essentially this right here, where it has this little particle effect that shoots around the Goppy. As you guys can see right here for the Galaxy one, it has this Galaxy particle that slowly fades in and out around the Goppy. Now, now, note that only the tier 5 Goppies can actually have this new Radiant tag on them. Now, of the three Goppies in the tier 5, each of those three have different Radiant particles on them, okay? Of course, you are seeing the one of them right here, which is the Galaxy Goppy, but later in the video, I'm actually going to be showing you guys the Neo Goppy or the Neo Crystal Goppy, and then I'm also going to be showing you guys the newly discovered Lightning or Storm Goppy particle, okay? So, let's go over the actual chances for what these Lumians are. And of course, I'm also going to be like putting, I guess, uh, the Gleaming Chance is in there as well because why not so tier 5 goppy odds of course you have the 1 in 1561 base odds just you know going out and finding a regular tier 5 and then the alpha is of course going to be a 1 in 80,000 and that of course is going into like the stuff like the green circle and the boost and the charm and all that but then you go into the radiant okay normal radiants are a 1 in 24,976 so essentially a 1 in 25,000 chance guys and then you go into the alpha radiant the Alpha Radiant is a 1 in 159,222. So something I gotta add right here, guys, is that if you actually find a Tier 5 Goppy on the wild, essentially what all of this means is that it is going to be a 1 in 16 chance to find it, okay? It is going to be a 1 in 16 chance for this Radiant tag to be on any Tier 5 Goppy you find, okay? But if you find an Alpha Tier 5 Goppy, okay? An Alpha Tier 5 Goppy has a 1 out of 2 chance to have a Radiant tag on it, okay? So, you essentially have a 50-50 chance of either getting a Radiant tag on it, or not getting a Radiant tag on it. You know, your odds are essentially just like a flip of a coin right there, so... Whoever finds, you know, a, an Alpha Goppy and it's, you know, not Radiant, I'm gonna feel really, really bad for them. But I think the Alpha versions actually would have, like, different uh, particles and stuff. Like, the colors would be different on them and all that stuff. So, yeah, those were all of the odds. Now, of course, let's go over some things like the actual Radiant itself, guys. The Radiant tag will appear inside of here. It'll have a little orange symbol right here. And it actually has a P shape, I'm pretty sure. And it will show inside of Trade as well. And also, guys, if you were wondering... Yes, if I actually go do a little bit of fishing right here, it will show inside of battle. And this also means that whenever you find it out in the wild, if you see it, you know, just like floating in the air and stuff, that like you see the particles, it will be inside of the battle as well. But, note again, that this can only be seen if you have your graphics turned up. Now, I'm going to run away from this Goppy, as you guys can see right here, and I'm going to go right into my settings and turn my graphics quality all the way down. As you guys can see... Right here, you know, you, it, the particle is just out. If I turn it all the way down, it's going to start essentially just fading away. So if you want to see the radiant, you're going to have to at least have your graphics up a little bit. It still will show like the sparkles and stuff. It'll have like a little bit of a, a particle around it, but you're not going to see it if you actually have it down. I'm going to try to turn it to maybe half. I think that that should be good enough to at least see most of it. Yeah, I'd, I'd say half is probably the way to go if you want to see like the entire thing or at least most of it, guys. So now let's go over the actual radians for all tier 5 goppies. Alright, so starting off, this is going to be the one you've seen all video, but this is going to be the Galaxy Goppy, okay? The Galaxy Goppies one is very, very cool. It has a nebula floating all around it with some stars in between, and the actual range on this thing is pretty big. I know you probably couldn't see it the entire video, but it actually is a pretty, a pretty big aura, as you can see right here, and shoots off a lot of stars the more graphics you have on. So, yeah, it also just features a pretty cool design in general, and I believe, again, with the the actual alpha thing it will change colors all right guys so this one is not going to be like live actual footage this one is going to be a video that i got yesterday of the neo crystal goppy this thing looks pretty awesome as you guys can see it essentially has these little crystals that shoot off from its body and spiral right up into the air this thing looks absolutely amazing and i really like how you know kind of unique it is i don't know what the mount for this would look like if it would like start shooting out to the side but regardless these little like gem wisp looking things look very very awesome i like the entire design of it again though you know it's they got like different colors every time that they go off and all around a really good one 
All right, guys, our final one is again going to be a Twitter video, and this one actually comes from It's Pops. I can't find the original owner of this, but he was the one that actually made this video and put it on Twitter. So this one looks absolutely amazing. As you guys can see right here, it's kind of got this like little shock, uh, little like thing going all around it, like these little lightning bolts that just travel all the way around its body. And if you guys were wondering, these actually do work on Arapaigos. I can't find the images for like all of the Arapaigos, so I'm just not going to include them, but you can kind of imagine what they would look like on it. But yes, yeah, so. This just looks really, really awesome and definitely matches the entire, like, blue lightning theme that they got going on right here. Again, a really, really awesome aura. So, yeah, guys, those were all of the radiance so far inside of Lumion Legacy. Definitely let me know what your favorite is down in the comments below. Again, mine is probably gonna have to be the, like, little galaxy one, because, I mean, hey, listen, it might be a little bit of a personal bias. I just think it looks really cool. You know, I like space and all that stuff, but definitely the electric one is going to be my second favorite, and the third one, I'm not saying that it looks bad. It actually looks pretty good as well but it will be my third favorite so yeah if you guys did enjoy this video make sure you hit another like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video peace